According to an article written by Mark Karasinko, more Filipino nurses are expected to leave the country as coronavirus border controls loosen and hiring gets more aggressive, putting the Philippines in a difficult position as it deals with its own shortage of healthcare professionals. Previously, between 13,000 and 22,000 nurses migrated each year to more developed countries where they could make substantially more. Good day to all! We are Group 1A of BSN3E and we are here to present our research entitled The Level of Agreement Towards Pursuing Job Opportunities Overseas Among Graduating Nursing Students. I'm Harold Nino Alisen and with me are my group members, Gerald Lois Aloria, Rian Levitri Angeles, Moira Arroyo, and Angelique Bernaga. The purpose of this study aimed to determine the level of agreement towards pursuing job opportunities overseas among graduating nursing students. Specifically, the study sought to answer the following questions. Number one, what is the profile of nursing students in the university according to age, sex, section, type of community, and monthly family income? Number two, what is the level of agreement towards pursuing job opportunities overseas among graduating nursing students according to salary and compensation, career prospects, quality of life, family and friends, and agreement to work abroad? And number three, is there a significant relationship between the level of agreement towards pursuing job opportunities overseas among graduating nursing students and its profile variables according to age, sex, section, type of community, and monthly family income. For the research design, descriptive correlational research design was utilized to measure the relationship between variables, examining how they are related to each other. Therefore, the method applied in this study utilized survey forms or questionnaires to gather data from the participants' responses. There were 160 out of 271 level 4 nursing students that were chosen as the participants. Stratified random sampling was used to determine the number of participants from the seven sections of the graduating nursing students. Every student was given an equal chance of being chosen in the probability sampling. The sample size was determined using Cochrane's formula with a 95% confidence level, 5% precision, and a maximum variability measure of 50% for the respondents' agreement to pursue overseas job opportunities. The researchers have utilized standardized questionnaires, which includes the Part 1, Profile of Participants, and Part 2, 5-point Likert Scale. So for the results in discussion, we'll start with Table 1, which is the demographic profile. The majority of participants, comprising 79.40%, are age 22 years old and below, and 71.90% are female. In this diagram, Section C exhibits the highest level of student participation, accounting for 15% of the total. The majority of participants comprising 66.90% are from the rural community. 28.1% of the participants' monthly family income mostly ranges from 48,329 to 84,574 pesos. Participants aging from 22 years old and below and 22 years old and above strongly agree that salary and compensation is a pulling factor towards pursuing job opportunities overseas. On the other hand, 22 years old and below agree that career prospects, quality of life, and family and friends are some other factors towards pursuing job opportunities. While 23 years old and above strongly agrees that quality of life overseas matters in terms of pursuing job opportunities overseas, other factors such as career prospects, family and friends, and agreement to work abroad, they only agree. So female participants strongly agree that salary and compensation may be a factor towards pursuing job opportunities overseas, while male only agrees that it is the factor. On the other hand, both male and female agree that career prospects, quality of life, family and friends are factors towards pursuing job opportunities. For this section, Section C consistently shows the highest level of agreement, while Section B generally has lower agreement levels compared to other sections. Type of Community in terms of salary and compensation, participants from urban and rural areas responded as strongly agree, while the participants from urban areas responded to agree. Other factors resulted to an agree response from all the participants such as career prospects, quality of life, family and friends, and agreement to work abroad. For the monthly family income, lower class, lower middle class, upper middle class, and upper class strongly agrees in terms of salary and compensation. And career prospect, Lower class strongly agrees, while the other classes only agrees. In terms of quality of life, lower class and upper class strongly agrees that quality of life is a factor in pursuing opportunities overseas. In terms of family and friends, the participants agrees. And lastly, in terms of agreement to work overseas, the participant level of agreement falls in agree. 
Next is for the relationship between the level of agreement towards pursuing job opportunities overseas among graduating nursing students and its profile variables. So first, the age. The results show that there was no significant relationship between age and salary and compensation, career prospects, quality of life, family and friends, and agreement to work abroad. The correlation coefficient values for each variables were quite low, indicating that there was no strong linear relationship between them. In sex, salary and compensation, career prospects, quality of life, and agreement to work abroad has no significant relationship, while family and friends has significant relationship. For the section, there is no significant relationship in all of the variables. For the type of community, the study found a significant relationship between type of community and salary compensation. However, there was no significant relationship between type of community and career prospects, quality of life, family and friends, and agreement to work abroad. The study found no significant relationship between monthly family income and salary compensation, career prospects, quality of life, family and friends in the agreement of nursing students to work abroad. These results suggest that monthly family income may not be a significant predictor of the career choices and agreement of graduating nursing students. In conclusion, our research findings shed light on several important aspects regarding the agreement of graduating nursing students to pursue job opportunities overseas. Firstly, our study reveals a high level of agreement among nursing students with a mean of 4.36% expressing a strong desire to work abroad. This indicates a significant trend within the nursing profession, reflecting the growing interest in international employment among the new generation of nurses. Based on an analysis of the demographic profile, it can be affirmed that the agreement of nursing students to seek job opportunities overseas remains unaffected. While based on the agreement, it can be deduced that the salary and compensation directly influence the agreement of graduating nursing students to pursue job opportunities abroad. And according to relationship, it can be ascertained that the demographic variable sex is significantly associated with family and friends, while the demographic variable type of community is significantly linked to salary and compensation. With our recommendation, for nursing school administrator, this research provides valuable insights into the degree of agreement among nursing students regarding international work opportunities, offering administrators pertinent information to identify potential approaches and areas for further research. While for nursing clinical instructor, the findings of this study can enrich teaching methodologies for nursing clinical instructors, aiding them in supporting students and serving as a foundation for the acquisition of professional knowledge, skills, and understanding. For graduating nursing students, they can utilize this research to make informed decisions about their future career paths. The information gathered and presented in this study can provide valuable insights into their level of agreement to pursue job opportunities abroad. Lastly, for the future researchers, this research can serve as a valuable reference for future researchers interested in conducting related studies. It can assist in designing precise investigations, identifying gaps in the existing body of knowledge, and facilitating the progression of research towards logical conclusions. To access our references, you may scan the QR code on our poster. Once again, this has been Group 1A e of BSN3E presenting you our research entitled The Level of Agreement Towards Pursuing Job Opportunities Overseas Among Graduating Nursing Students. Thank you for watching and mabuhay!